Hi guys, welcome back to the Dumpling Sisters Kitchen. In this series, we're using some of our favourite blue dragon ingredients to whip up four of our tastiest Thai inspired dishes. Today we're cooking up a sensational salmon dish with the crispiest skin and a simple but flavour packed red curry sauce. It's exactly the kind of thing to make if you're after maximum flavour in minimal time. So let's get started. So the first thing that we're going to do is prepare the garnish which we're going to have on our salmon. It's a combination of three really flavoursome ingredients. The first one is this here, which is Thai basil. You might have heard of this before, but it's actually very different to normal basil in that it is Thai based and very aniseedy, and the leaves are quite sharp as opposed to being rounded. So we're just going to pop that straight into our mortar and pestle, leaving a little bit to sprinkle on at the end. And then half a red chilli and some grated ginger. And now, just to loosen things up a little bit, a wee bit of vegetable oil. And now my favourite part, the mashing. Ah, yep, yeah, that's exactly how we want it. Not too fine, but you can see that the oil has been really flavoured by those ingredients. So no worries if you don't have one of these sets, just chuck all of these ingredients into food processor and it'll do the same job. So the base for our simple but delicious sauce is red curry paste. So here I have a handy little pot which I'm just going to fry off. And a little drizzle of oil just to help things along. And to that we're going to add some coconut milk, some fish sauce, some sugar to balance out those sour flavours and the juice of half a lime. Then mix that up and we're going to let that simmer away whilst we're cooking the salmon. Now we're ready to cook the salmon. Now we love a crispy skin on our salmon. So we're going to put a little bit of TLC into it. You're going to have the most amazing crisp. So first of all, we just have two fillets of salmon here and you need some salt to start off with. So a generous amount helps to crispen up that skin along with some black pepper. Right, so that pan is lovely and hot now. So just a little dash of oil. Don't need too much because there's quite a bit of oil in the skin of the salmon itself. And then lay your salmon in. So at this point, just turn the heat down to medium low so the skin can get really crispy and the inside will cook perfectly through. And to ensure maximal crispiness, the hold salmon down with the tong. That's just about ready to be turned over. They're about halfway cooked. So quick season on the side. Beautiful. So I can't wait to put this all together. This salmon is great with rice. You can find our recipe for perfect fluffy rice by clicking the i button in the corner. Nestle that in there. Mmm. That sauce. Get plenty of that on there. And put dollops around of that delicious flavoured oil. A dash of coconut milk to help cool that curry. A few tendrils of the Thai basil we saved earlier. And finally, a bit of chopped chilli. So there you have it guys, this is our take on crispy skin salmon with a red curry sauce and I cannot wait to tuck it in. I'm going to tuck in the salmon first. Mmm! Mm. How is that? Is it mm. good? Mm. So yum! Mmm, you taste a bit of everything. I think what's really good about using salmon um, with Thai flavours is that salmon itself also has a really strong flavour so it can really mm. stand up to the boldness of the sauce. It's definitely like a robust fish. Mm. Um, and mm. This, mm, the Thai basil, especially when it's been pounded with that oil, it's released all the aromatic flavours. Make sure you check out the other videos that we have in the series full of mm. Thai delicious flavours as well. <laughs> and we will see you next time. Bye! Bye.